welcome to what's really going on. G-Money, I got some important people here tonight uh, that you can't get. See, I get important people to come down to the show. As uh, up and coming producer, I'm gonna let him talk for itself. <laughs> and uh, Money, if you show your beady ass <laughs> or get that ugly Lobo, three bitten month to come down here tonight, it's gonna be some trouble in A-Town. You got that? He's a free bitten mutt, just like his mother. And if you don't like what I'm saying, all you have to do is show up. Ladies and gentlemen, get on the telephone. I want you to see the man. Ladies, I got the man here tonight. Furry is in the house with the yeah. big bad wolf. I'm going to let him come and talk about producing. I think he's an up-and-coming producer. Up-and-coming producer. Up-and-coming producer. Hip-hop producer. All and, uh, right about now, I'd like to introduce Furry. Welcome, Furry, to the show. How you doing? Uh, we like to get a little background on you. Could you, you know, tell us something about yourself, you know? Well, my... Uh, this is your, your spot. Go on and get down a little bit. Tell us something about yourself. I'm a hip-hop R&B producer out of New Jersey, Dover, New Jersey. And I produce uh, a group of fellows named Nujeru Entertainment. It's uh, three groups, three separate groups, all hip-hop groups. We also have some young ladies, upcoming young ladies singers. But right now, I'm just focusing on, you know, those guys. And um, basically, right now, we have an album recorded. We're trying to get a, a production deal with a major distribution, you know, uh, promotions and all that stuff. So, um, you know, we hit a lot of spots in Atlanta, doing a lot of shows, trying to get a lot of promotions around Atlanta and hope to soon go national with everything. Okay, now wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay. I want to talk about you. Let's talk about you just a little that bit. That is great. That is Get a little great. flavor. You know about growing up and what made you be a producer? In case what the young people out there want to be listening a to, what got um, you into producing? Listening to old hip hop records back in the day, back in 80 something listening to old hip hop records, then listening to um, like 70s music, you know, then I wanted to do what everybody else was doing. They were sampling the stuff and then putting some drums to it. So I wanted to do my thing the way I wanted to do it. So then I started back then, I started um, DJing a little bit. That's what got me into rapping because, uh, you know, I was making the beats and then I needed somebody to rap over the beats. So then I started rapping. And, um, you know, I just kept going years and years. So you did this, all of this at a, uh, an early age. Where are you early from? Early age. Tell me where Jersey, New Jersey. New Jersey. Dover, so we New got Jersey, the Eastern East flavor. New Jersey, yeah. The East up is north. in the house tonight representing. East up We'd like to welcome you to the, you know, down to Atlanta. Uh, Thank you. This is a hippie show in the G-Money. I want to know if you out there looking. See, I told you, Money that I go get important people. I got a man from the East. He's young, girls. I got him in the house. Let's call your girlfriend so y'all can get a look at him. Fury is in the house. We gonna get a little background. You know, I'm asking what kind of ladies he like, you know. We gonna go down, get the whole nine. But right now we finding out what, where's he from and you know, what he like to do. So you from the East Coast. And East Coast. How long you been in Atlanta? I've been in Atlanta for what, three years, almost four years. I think, yeah, I graduated high school as a senior here in Atlanta and um, just kept doing music. I went to the Arts Institute for a small amount of time, but I figured it wasn't for me. You know, I was supposed to be doing my music all the way the way I wanted to do it. So uh, I stopped going to the Arts Institute and just started focusing more on my music. And that's what I do all day, every day, music. So you've been in this, your own production company, is that right? Mm-hmm. Right. We're looking for a record, then I think we got the music playing in the background for the people who want to listen to what the flavor. I got everything working here. Big bad, look, G Money. You can't get important <laughs> people like me. Now I met this young man, and he gave me some vibes and said he likes to come down and be on the show. Anybody else out there? I'm opening up the show. You want to be a guest on the show just to come and talk to Big Bad. When the number comes up on the screen or whatever, give me a call and you too can be a guest. But right now I got Furry in the house. We're gonna talk about some ladies now. You know, what, what does he like um, in a lady? Don't break like, it down. 
I like all types of ladies. Um, it just depends on. <laughs> It just depends on the lady, you know. I like a light, dark, um, short, tall, slim, thick, whatever. Just okay, that's on. physical. Let's get with the mental. What do y'all yeah, like mental, to be treated? What do um, you like? Come on. Oh, I like to be treated like. Now, who wants the girls call up? Who you want to call? Who I want to call? Who me? you want to call? What kind of lady you want to call right now? <laughs> <laughs> um, all of them, really. <laughs> you want? Oh, I love him, and then, you know, we get a little. Yeah, got a wolf in him, too. I see that now. He's a little, got a little wolf in him, too. He wants everybody to call. But what specifically? What kind, you know, what in a lady? What would, uh, if you want someone to, to be with, who would you, what would you want him to be? Uh, what would I want him to be? I want him to look like Tony Braxton. All right, Tony. Got some Tony Braxton man in the house. Yeah. What about the intelligence here? Intelligence? Oh, they got to they gotta have some kind of intelligence. Intelligence, you know, they like can't intelligence? over intelligence me. Or, or <laughs> Come on, I mean, <laughs> smarter than me. Baby girl smarter than me. She got my back. G money. Are you out there, money? Are you out there, money? You know, Red loves me, don't you? And you just can't stand that. She's the only one that got my back. And if it wasn't for Red, you would have been to destroy me. And I'm not going to stop her anymore. You know, how you don't like that hot lead she put in your leg. You don't like that, did you? I'm not stopping her anymore. You want to play like we the bad guys when all alone is you, money, because you got all the money and all the power and normal people. You look down on us like we ain't got nothing going on. But I'm going to show you some money. I'm going to show you what's really going on, okay? Now, we're going to get back to Furry and talk a little bit about uh, the, the production company. How long did it production. take you to start this up? Um, well, it took us like two years, I think, or about a year and a half. Because a year and a half ago, me and my man Shogun, he's also from Jersey. He lives here in Atlanta right now. And um, we started like, you know, a year and a half ago. And it's just took a lot of work, hard work to get where we are now. We're still not on the top like we want to be, but, you know, it took, takes hard work. So where did, where, where did you do your recording? I mean, when you say you first started, um, you doing a big studio? Or you oh, now when I first started. In a home started, studio? Or we at? have a home studio. Home That's what studio. we okay. recording right now. Um, we have, what do we have? Uh, a track, A dot, yeah. and um, <laughs> we also record in different studios, you know, studios around Atlanta, bigger studios. Okay. The uh, two track SSL studios, but um, right now we're just working on our new stuff, you know, at our home studio. So, what kind of stuff? If I bought the CD or album, what, what would I get? Um, you get flavor, get flavor. Or a different flavor. Get some flavor, huh? Okay, well, I mean, what does it, what are your songs about? You know, I read um, some about your bio, but what do they, you know? Kind of, what do you rap about? I mean, we rap about life, everything, life. everything that goes on in your life. You know, you listen to our tape, and then you'll see that we were going through the same thing at the time. You know, basically, it's just all on life. Different now, subjects can anybody buy the CD? Is it X-rated, or do you cuss? I'm oh, yeah, yeah, we do. We do a lot cussing. of cursing, yeah. See, man, that. I like cussing. You don't like rap, do you? That's why I'm hosting the show. I'm taking your spot. I cuss. Hey, everybody knows the big bad wolf is nasty, OK? I, I ain't making no qualms about it. You don't like it, G-Money? That's just too bad. Come on down here. You got your gun? Where you at? With your 45s and your revolvers you carry. Next time I get you money, I'm going to take that revolver. And I'm going to stick it so far up your butt, you're going to need a case of enemies to get it out. <laughs> I'm going back to my man for it. For it. I'm sorry. So but there's a lot of violence that go down here. You're not a, you're new here. Mm -hmm. G Money is he just abused me every chance he get, and I'm not taking it no more. And Lobo, if you out there looking with your ugly face, flea bitten mud mangy, just like your mother, why don't you <laughs> and G Money come down here tonight? You know what? I'm gonna tell you why you ain't gonna show your ugly face tonight. <laughs> First of all, I'm not going to be embarrassed in front of Furry, and I'm going to whoop the sliver. That's okay. I'll save that later. I don't like to get too balanced. Kids, it is wrong to be balanced, but you can only take so much, 
And G Money, I'm not taking no more off you. And you better be scared of the big bad wolf. Okay, Furry. Right. Now your production company. How many groups you say you have? Um, it's what it's two groups and also myself. The groups are Red Brain. That's Red what, Rain. Red Brain. Okay, and break it down. Uh, Red Rain has two members, two members, Fidel the Microphone Controller and Bias the Lyrical Exorcist. Wait a minute, and break that down again. Right here, that's a little bit too fast. Say that again. Bias the Lyrical Exorcist. Oh, who's the other one? And Fidel the Microphone Controller. Can I get them to come down and be with Big Bad on the show? I don't know. They busy, you know. They busy. There's anyway, much shit we can do. that you can call them and ask them yeah, to I can come down them. and be on the show with you. Yeah, me. I can do that. I can Lady, do that. Gentlemen, Red Lane, G Money, I promise to bring the best in entertainment. No doubt. My man Furry said he'll get on the phone next week, maybe. Maybe next not. Week. Stay tuned, maybe next week. Red Lane will be right here. Definitely. Rapping. Definitely. We're going to let him rap in it. Yeah, you do whatever. Hot rap? Do a show, all that. You want to see the men? Next week, ladies and gentlemen, right here on what's really going on, I'm going to have Red Lane. Who else you got going on? We got uh, unorthodox. Unorthodox. Oh, unorthodox. Okay. Some unorthodox. That's uh, crazy. What they all about? They are uh, unorthodox. They're my unorthodox. man, True Rock, and unorthodox. My man, Big Chief, and uh, my man, Lord Paul. They are from you know different parts of the. Where Big Chief from? You know, I did Big a Chief, reading. he from uh, <laughs> Cincinnati. 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 Okay, Cincinnati. where's the? Uh, Lord Paul is from Ohio, so that's, Ohio, that's Chicago, all Columbus. Columbus. That's all Ohio, Columbus, Columbus. Ohio. Se all somewhere in Chicago. Chicago, where are you from? Um, <laughs> Chicago, 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 Chicago. Chicago. yeah, Chicago. That's Chicago in the house, so we yeah, got yeah. Chicago and Cincinnati. Yeah, got yeah. a little Midwest flavor coming yeah. here. And Next then, week, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> unorthodox week after the red rain, you, can they come and see me too? Oh yeah, they can come see me too. Boston Entertainment. I got Red Rain coming. Stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen. They gonna rap on the show and all that. They gonna rap. They gonna get rap. them to rap. We are gonna let them interview. We're gonna let them get loose, get goofy loose or whatever. Girls, I'm bringing. They say you say you never get nobody. I'm bringing you some young men. Okay. Knock your pants off. Is that right? That's right. Just like the big bad wolf do, and you know Red, Red Baby Gub, you out there. I'm gonna give a shout out. I'm gonna let Rain, my boy Fury, over give some shots out in a little bit. Oh, but I want to give a shout out to Little Red Rider. In fact, I think I get Red to interview Rain. Yeah, I'm gonna give my baby girl to interview them next week, ladies and gentlemen. I promise Red Rider is coming out here to the stage. Okay, now let's get back to the groups. Okay, you say you got. Unorthodox. Unorthodox. Chicago. Chicago, um, Cincinnati, and my man True Rock is from LA. LA. Los Angeles, California. Oh, so we got the whole nation here. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And yeah, that's there. how you call it unorthodox, huh? Unorthodox. Got to go. Okay. From and everywhere. you from New York? No, I'm from Jersey. Jersey. Same thing, eh? Huh? That same thing? Nah, nah. That same nah, thing. Okay, nah, he's nah, from nah. the east. Uh, I think it's about 20 miles different. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So. Okay, I've never been to New Jersey. Yeah, okay, so you, how how long did you take to you know to, mold these groups? And, um, did they perform they, or what? Yeah, perform everywhere all the time in okay. Atlanta. You know, um, it's easy to catch us. Usually we do a show uh, most times once a week, uh, different clubs, you know, whatever. And um, you so know, I can they, catch them right here in Atlanta. Yeah, yeah, and um, you know we go out of town every so often. Go out of town, but basically right now we're focusing on Atlanta to get our, you know, crowd based around Atlanta first before we expand. So we can see them in Atlanta? Yeah, yeah, all the time. Okay. Both groups, Red Both Rain groups. and Unlock the Docks. Okay, I like that on Unlock the Docks. I'm going to give my baby girl Red a, I'm going to let her host. See, money? You ain't stopping the Big Bad Wolf no more. Red is going to be hosting some shows. You hear that? And I might, I'm going to bring her out a little bit later. How much time we got, director? What the time look like in there? Okay, we got about five more minutes to go. Hey, up a call on the phone. You want to be a guest. You know, and I, Big Bad's opening up the show a little bit. You might not have no talent. You just might want to come talk about a problem. You, you want to talk to Big Bad, give me a call. G-Money, you might not like that. 
this is your show and only important people can come on the show. I agree with that. I agree with that. 75% of the time. Now the hell, you got that money? Because I'm opening up for a ladder to come down, the wall to come down, to sit and talk to Mr. Big Bad. Okay. Now we got your group performing. Uh, any uh, long tone long, long term goals? Goals, um, our own label, right. you know, distribution on a major label. Because right now we have an independent label, but we need a uh, major distribution, okay. you know, to get the record out there. All so right, that's cool. the long term goals. And then, uh, you know, the groups are going to have solo albums. Each okay. person in the group are going to drop their own little solo album, keep everything going. Then we got, you know, other upcoming acts, like I told you before. So, we just so what, what's on this album you got now? You, you bought me some. Where's the album? I think I see my baby girl Red. Hey Red, you got that album in there? That little, the, the album CD or tape? We got that tape out there? It's kind of somewhere. No, where's the tape cover? The tape cover's in there? Or do we have a, t a cover of the tape? Yeah, hey, they got it. Somewhere. They got it? I know Is they it got it. it. Anybody see the tape cover? Yeah. Oh, that's my baby. Come here, Red. G Money. <laughs> I want you to eat your heart out. Cause baby girl's here tonight. Like hey I promise. God. Come here, baby girl. Just come on in here. Have a seat with Big Bang. No, you come on <laughs> sit with Come on, sit down. Come on over here. Oh, you uh, see that uh, man? Come on, sit with You ain't gonna sit over here. Come on over here. <laughs> I want you to sit up with Big Bang. I want G Money to be jealous. See that money? Give me a close up here, director. I want G Money. To swallow in his lust. See that money? Got my boy. You want to hold that for me, man? <laughs> right here. Bringing the best in entertainment. This nice. New Jeru. New Jeru. New Jeru. Right here. And what's right really here. going on? Got That's baby sweet. girl red. See money? I know you hate that. That red loves me. You hate seeing us together like this, don't you? You know why? I'm going to tell you why. Because you want to for yourself. You can't have me. Never. Ever. You're never, ever, ever. going to have me. Going to get it. You got that money? Oh, don't, don't do that, man. I can't take the money. <laughs> Might have to call the doctor. The, the doctor in the house today. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, doctor, oh, Lord, I'm in trouble. Okay, I got my man Furry here. He yeah. promised to bring uh, Red Rain. Red Rain coming here. Unorthodox. And unorthodox is coming right here. Next in. week, ASAP, as soon as possible. Red, would you host the show for me next week? I'll do that for you. Money? I'll do that for my baby. Girl. You hear that, Money? Red is going to take your spot on what's really going on. You got that? And you might like that because you want to see it, don't you? You like looking at her legs, don't you? Because you want her. Don't let him look, baby. For yourself, and you're not going to get it. And how much time I got left here, producer? What we look like on the time? You're on 19 now. We're on 19. I got to go. I'd like to thank Fury, New Jeru, New Jeru. producer, for coming down and being with me. I'd like to especially thank Red for coming right. down. Oh, my God. Stay tuned next week. What's really going on? We got Red Rain. Red Rain. We got the next Unorthodox. Thank you very much for what's really going on.